Today we have, have a volume 1, issue number 15, 1977, Iron Fist. So this is CGC graded at a 7.5. Um, there's a shot of the label for you. And here's the comic here. This Iron Fist is really neat. I like this a lot. You can see Iron Fist down there battling it out with all of the X-Men. I really like this comic. I think that it is overlooked because there's a lot of new Iron Fist fans just from the Netflix series and, and all that all that stuff, so it's getting a little more popularity. And so with that, I think there's a lot of Iron Fist fans that aren't that familiar with the comics. And so people are focusing on um, a lot of the other issues, obviously number one. And then number issue number 14, as a lot of you know, is the first appearance of Sabretooth. And so because this issue is right after that, I think a lot of people are focusing on on that issue. And also, usually if you like if you just type in Iron Fist number 15, this comic doesn't pop up. The comic that does pop up is Iron Fist's first appearance. So a lot of people don't know about this issue, especially the new fans, and it's really overlooked. So I think the value on this comic is probably going to go up quite a bit in the not too distant future. So that's why I think that this is a good buy right now. As far as the actual story, if you're not familiar with the story of this issue, it's pretty hilarious. Iron Fist, basically he walks into his friend's apartment and his friend isn't there, but her roommate is and she's having a party. Coincidentally, all the X-Men, not all of them, but quite a few X-Men are at the party. And so when he walks in, Wolverine's like, who's this guy? And just attacks the Iron Fist and then they just start brawling it out and then the other X-Men jump in and before you know it, it's Iron Fist versus all of the X-Men, which is pretty funny. They're just having a, a little uh, party brawl, which just turns out to be a, mis a big misunderstanding. So the story in this is kind of funny with all the X-Men kind of appearing in the Iron Fist here. So I really like that. Um, and also just the artwork is really cool. You get that cool old vintage artwork. You have all the, the X-Men there and Iron Fist. It looks like he just smashed through Colossus there with his, with his fists all lit up and Storm Wolverine in the background. And we have Nightcrawler down there laying on the ground like, who the heck is this guy? So all in all, the, the artwork is pretty neat. As far as the actual comic goes, even though this is a 7.5, which is a decent grade, um, the comic is in really good shape. I think it got a low grade probably because of the pages. You can see on the side there how dark the pages on the inside are. But the actual cover is really good condition. You have a little bit of wear on the top, you can see. Um, but let's take a look on the side, a little bit on the corner. Um, but the rest of this edge is really good and the colors are very vibrant. It looks good, they're not faded or anything like that. And you can see a little bit of wear on that corner down there. There's Nightcrawler again. <laughs> Um, and then on the spine, there's a little bit, I uh, keep in mind, this is pretty close up and a really good resolution. So when you're actually looking at it, most of the stuff doesn't even, you can't even really see it. So it, it's good. You're getting a really good, um, high definition view of this comic all the way around. So as you can see, this comic is in really good shape. So what we're going to do for this comic is, uh, pricing on this is pretty hard because I feel like this comic is all over the place. Um, recently, I've seen them maybe like in the last six months going back sell for $5, and I've also seen them sell for $30. This is for an ungraded comic. In the last three months on eBay, ungraded ones around this condition, uh, if you send them in, they probably get between like a six and an eight from CGC. I've seen them more commonly between 12 and 18 bucks is Probably the most consistent I've seen them, but prices are all over the place. So um, with with that price, I think the $50 price range is pretty fair for this thing to be graded. So what we're gonna do is I'll probably post this around 55 bucks, but do keep in mind, I sell direct. Let's take a, a back shot of this uh, real quick. I do sell direct. So if you're not wanting to go through eBay and just wanna deal with me directly, I do do that. And for all of my direct buyers, I do um, take 5% off of your order. So you'll get a 5% discount. Um, so this comic will probably be, you know, $55 plus shipping. And then you can get the discount if you want to buy direct. And also with that, if you see a few comics up on my store that you want, that's buy it out now, um, let me know. And I'll combine shipping and just give you a good discount. So let me know if there's some stuff you're, you're interested. Thank you for watching.